Let us look at how to enable macros within your forms. Now I'm using a sample form here, but uh, the procedure for every kind of form, any kind, any kind, is the same. So we're just going to look at how it is done in this very form, and then you can replicate the knowledge learned here in any other form that you get. So I open the form, and. I get a security warning in this bar here that macros have been disabled so I click options and then I enable this content and I choose OK right so now I can begin working with a form and do anything because macros have been enabled through and through so I can click next and do anything of the sort uh, that is the way we can do it uh, to temporarily enable macros while within the URL forms. Now, any other way, the other way to enable macros within these URL forms permanently, permanent, permanently enable these macros. Now, to do that, you still go back to open the form, and then this time you go to the office button. And then you come down to the Excel options and to the Trust Center, Trust Center settings, macro settings, and you enable these macros completely, though this is somehow not recommended, but it will save you the burden of every time enabling macros when you open your forms. So when I choose OK and I close the form, macros will be enabled the next time I open the form. So when I close now and open again, poof, macros have been enabled automatically. That's why you're able to see this message box here. So I just choose OK here and then I begin to fill the form without any bother. I think we can use this to deal with all the other forms that URA offers you. Thank you.